Hey everyone, this is a bad review. Today I'm going to re be reviewing this Grey Deadpool from the Marvel Legends Sasquatch Build Figure Wave. So, let's get to it. Okay, so I have gotten him out of the packaging. Here he is. Uh, I'm going to look at the figure, then the Build the Figure piece and the accessories. So, really nice head. The only thing I see right there, see right there, some paint missing. But aside from that, and right there on the other side, it's pretty good. Uh, right here, there's some some paint defect. I'm gonna try and I'll try that later. Um, it comes with. Uh, a peg hole, it's got a peg hole in the back, really nice, uh, I will go over the articulation also, so let's get to the accessories, so here's the Sasquatch build figure head, so this is a different joint than most of my build figures so it's gonna be weird, and then he's got swords, a gun, or two swords and two guns. I don't really like the guns because they look fake, but he does have holster for the swords and the gun. I'm gonna show off the gun and the holster. So just lift his arm up a bit, slip, slide that right on in, and you have the gun and the holster now. And then for the swords, it's also easy. So let's slide them out of the packaging. And the swords are actually really nice. Really like this red on the handle. And they're not warped at all. Like they're straight. And then to demonstrate putting them in the back. See the bottom is slanted. According to the swords. So. That. There's, that's what, there it is. And then. Okay, and then this one goes on the other side. There. And then now you have his swords and his pistol and his holsters. But they do not have a holster for this! Why would you give him a gun? Like, you have holsters for everything else, but no holster for this one? So, that's the only thing I don't like. Um, so I'm gonna do so, I'm gonna do the articulation, and then compare him with some other action figures. So his head can look up that far and look down that much. Arms do, can do a full 360, go up that far, not all the way down, actually. They can go down pretty far. Bicep swivel, sw bicep swivel, yeah, double jointed elbow that can only go in that far. So I force it, um, and then wrist that turn side to side, and do not, they're really tight, so can't really move them all that well. She's got an ab crunch that can go that far forward, that far back. Waist swivel, kick, uh, kick, and bring, kick his leg that far forward, that far back, but, uh, upper thigh cut. Double jointed knees and a calf rotation, and the ankles move up and down, and it does have an ankle pivot. So, so here's the Deadpool just doing a vanilla pose. I'm gonna compare him with his with some other Deadpools and other action figures from Marvel Legends, Dragon Stars, and Ashes Figure Arts, and such. So, here he is standing. I do not have Cap Shield with me, but here he is. He's next. He's next to Endgame Cap. Hold on, he's got to stand Cap up. He's next to Endgame Cap. Sorry about that. I ran out of space, so I just had to delete a couple things. So where? Okay, so where I was, I just compared him next to that one. So here he's next to the Infinity War Cap, looking pretty good. Um, and then some of his Deadpool brother in, and hold on, he's got to change his stance, his feet are flat, there, he is next to the Deadpool, 
from the Earth to the X Men Deadpool. Pretty good. And also Venom Pool. Looks pretty good with the three of them. So I would get this figure to have them compared to next to next to other Deadpools. And then just because I have them and I like to use them, I have them next to Dragon Stars, Super Saiyan Goku. I will try to get I'm try, I really do want to try and get a normal Goku. And a Super Saiyan a Trunks from Ashes Figure Arts. Way shorter. Or way taller than Trunks. So that's all for this video. I hope you guys liked it, and I next review I will try and get more reviews up. So see ya. So this video is a lot different because I'm filming in a different area, and that's why you have a different table and stuff. And uh, so we just have a lot of stuff. Um, we're in a sh in the shed in the back, so it's just a lot different than normal. So that and then. Uh, things are just changing for how we make videos to now. Just wanted to tell you guys that, uh... We should talk about this guy. Which one? What do you this mean? Guy. Why? Don't you remember? What do you mean? He's the very first one. Oh, yeah, and I can't believe I've come this far from my first... This is the first, uh, Marvel Legends figure I've ever gotten. And now I have so much. I, I just, this is just a couple of my action figures. I have so much more that, like, I am so excited. And this guy started my collection. This one and this one were in a video. Yeah. So now they got another brother. Now they have more. Yeah, I have, uh, once I do finish the Sasquatch wave, which I, every, I was trying, like, every review I start, every, Wave I started trying to finish. That's why I begged my mom to get me the all of the uh, Thanos this stuff the and Thanos. Sasquatch. I will try and finish this wave. And there's another Deadpool in that wave, so I will have four four Deadpool's by the time I finish the Sasquatch wave. I can't wait. And this gun, I've got. This is the second gun I have with this one. So I don't really like the guns because they look fake. But every besides that, everything else looks amazing on this figure. So I do recommend getting this figure. It's awesome. So hope you guys liked the video. See you next time. Bye.